How's it going there, the internet? More driving, which means more vlogging. It's the reflective teacher. Teach thought 30 day, 30 days late reflective challenge. And I'm gonna knock out right now, day 25. What is the ideal collaboration between students and uh, what does it look like? You'll notice I'm on the freeway, so it'll be a lot more mirror checking. If I pause and just seem like I'm looking really intently, it's because there is a merging situation. So don't worry. See, there was, there was an on-ramp. Had to, had to, anyway, day 25, ideal collaboration between students. This one's really hard because you have to win over the culture of your class, really, to get them to truly collaborate because I think um, truly like awesome and perfect collaboration uh, it has to be meaningful for the students should include a large amount of discourse and it needs to really be self-motivated they can't be doing it because you told them to because otherwise they're really it's, it's not going to be a true collaboration it's going to be you know one kid does all the work and the other kid sits there and leeches off the situation and yeah so you have to really um, get them to a point where the culture is such in your classroom that learning is so important that they just they have to do it and that will uh, that will I think lead to really nice collaboration uh, and there's lots of tools and tricks you can do with your collaboration actually just as some uh, professional development with Bonnie Buffington and she had this really cool book that she uh, uh, helped author called the strategy ring that all like really cool little ideas and really like neat little tricks of how to get the kids to collaborate a bunch because one of the things I've found too is anytime you do any one thing too many times the kids get really sick of it so if you can have the kids you know if you can mix up what they think they're doing and really they're still collaborating and still doing all of the same thing basically uh, as far as learning goes then it keeps it fresh so it's, it's kind of a cool like bunch of strategies that uh, Bonnie Buffett came up. So shout out to her. Uh, what do you guys think? What's your ideal collaboration? Maybe not uh, with students, maybe with your kids, maybe in the workplace. What do you think? Put your comments down below in the commenty area. How are you if you're feeling wacky? You could do a video response. Thanks for watching, everybody.